Hi, my name is Grace, and in honor of Women's History Month and for the people and kids, today we'll be reading Good Night Stories for Rebel Girls, A Hundred Tales of Extraordinary Women. <laughs> today we'll be reading about the Mirabel sisters, who were activists. When a cruel dictator named Rafael Trujillo took in power of the Dominican Republic, four sisters started to fight for freedom. They were the Mirabel sisters. Minerva, Patria, Marisa Teresa, and Didi. People also called them Las Mariposas, the Butterflies. They distributed pamphlets and organized a movement to protest Trujillo and restore democracy in their country. Trujillo didn't like it. In his worldview, girls like the Minerva sisters were supposed to be good company for parties. They were supposed to compliment him, receive flowers and gifts, smile, and say thank you. They were not supposed to raise their voice to disagree or even try to overturn his regime. The butterflies' fierce independence scared him, so he tried several different strategies to silence them. He put them in jail, he buried them for practicing law, he imprisoned Maniba and her mother in a hotel room. He even tried to seduce, seduce Minerva, but Minerva said no. She was not up for sale. She didn't care about becoming the girlfriend of a powerful tribe. She only cared for freedom and for her country. The sisters' courage inspired the Dominicans and gave them strength to oppose Trujillo's regime. Eventually, he was taken down. On the 137-foot obelisk that Trujillo had erected to celebrate his power, today, there's mutual celebrating the Mirabel sisters, four sisters who defied a tribe.